following. Uh, well, let's get a common denominator of cosecant squared. Um, excuse me, cosecant squared iota. Yeah, that's the Greek Greek letter. All right, so we're gonna get um, in the numerator. I'm just gonna use theta. And this becomes minus one because you distribute the minus minus here. And this is going to be over cosecant squared iota or theta minus one. So these cancel out and we get negative two on top. And the cool thing about this is it's the cotangent squared theta. So we get negative two over cotangent. And when you divide by cotangent, it's the same thing as the tangent. So we end up with negative two tangent squared iota. Iota. And that's it. All right. I hope this helped you out. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.